Hey guys, good day to you. Today I would like to share with you this、uh, effect. Actually, is very good for your product. So this is the I call this name is the roller a、uh, roller machine animation. So he will look like this. So first of all, you just log into your Canva account. Even you are Canva free user. Also can achieve this effect. Okay, so first we click the video、uh, playing page. Okay, now we no need to adjust this five second. Just remain first. So this is a、um, uh, white playing color. So you can upload your product. So for example, I already upload my product is. Just wait for the wall.、Uh, it's this. It's the shoes. Okay. So after that, this shoe is、um, already remove the breakdown. So you have to make it remove breakdown. It make you more easy to achieve this one. So first, I、um, I just、uh, need three. Shoe for the page, and then I make this photo to、um, center like this. So now you can see here I already、um, make this one file, and then this is called where is it? Size? Not size. Sorry, the file, and then. Okay,、uh, view setting, and then I click for the show ruler and guide. So I click here, click and drag to the center. So this is the center. Okay, now I already have three shoe over here. So what I want to do is I want to separate individually. So I just right click, duplicate one more. Okay, now I just、uh, put it. In same location, and then I crop or I reduce. I know I reduce. I say I think it's crop, crop to this one shoe. Okay, then I just click this one, and then I right click, duplicate one more, and then put to the same place. Now this time I have. To crop to here, so this is individual. This one also individual. But don't forget, this center one is three shoe in the photo. So now what I want to do is, I also make it to the to the individual. So this three shoe is individually. Okay. Now in this shoe, I want to make. Make this shoe becoming larger. Okay, larger like this. Okay, then I put into the center. So now these two shoe, I want to make it a little bit smaller to make this blue color shoe look like more bigger. Because I want this one look like more、uh, focus about it. So now this one I also reduce the size. So when we reduce this shoe, and then we can see they have、uh, some line to here. Okay, you can see this one. This one shoe is matched with number one, the shoe, the the sizes. Okay. Where is this sizes? Okay, never mind. We can click this one to more easily is click this top ruler to going down to here, and then click and drag one more to the top over here. So once we click here, can make us more easy to manage. Okay, to manage. Okay, like this. Okay, now. 
this uh, center one is big uh, the shoe is look like more huge okay more center and then these two shoe is smaller than the middle one so what I want to do is click this three dot over here then duplicate the page okay now this second page I want to do is this blue color shoe going to the number one area number one area the shoe going to number three this number three the number number three the shoe we go to the center to replace the blue color and then this shoe is more bigger than that okay so now just click here okay now uh, we click back to this center the shoe drag and drop the the guideline for this area so we will make us more easy to achieve it so click this shoe and and then make this shoe coming oops sorry click this shoe oops so sometime we need to be careful okay so like this what I want to do is coming here okay the arrow change so I make this shoe more bigger after you see this arrow change sometimes it's quite tricky so please pay attention okay never mind we just repeat first this one make to touching here so this shoe is more bigger so I will put on the center and then I right click layer okay send to the back okay so this blue shoe I want Okay, this one adjust it this one i can make the shoe becoming smaller okay smaller then i try to make the shoe match the shoe okay now it's matching okay you can see this two is matching so this one will replace here okay so this one blue i will put to the first location or the number one the location and then this I will put to the number three area so now it look like replace it okay so now what I want to do is I will put it back this okay blue color guideline put it back okay this one as well okay this one okay never mind this one replace it so now i want to duplicate one more time this page number two duplicate one more so now this center one need to replace to number one this we put center the blue will go in back to number three location or the number three area so now same like the previous one we will make this one okay we move this one make touching over the top area so now this shoe will be look like more bigger but still look like very small so what i want to do is i will make this shoe look like more bigger okay and then put in the, to the center like this right click click layer send to the back so this now this one I want to reduce the size same like a blue shoe okay blue shoe okay here he will come out to the the light okay now when the, my area going here we can see the size a little bit smaller so I need to adjust a bit okay now is okay so this one I will put to behind or maybe on the top but never mind after you put it in the correct way just click outside and then we want to click the blue color to adjust to the behind here okay so now once it's everything done okay if you see this standard shoe is still not good enough so no good enough big you just adjust a little bit more 
okay now everything when is okay just remove the um, this guideline you can click one by one to the guideline and then remove it okay so page number one number two and number three is done so now what I want to do is I repeat this page we click this three dot and then duplicate the page okay this page number two I will put to number four okay never mind I just click one more plain page and then this blue shoe I will put to this page number four then we come into the this page page number two I will duplicate so that will do two and number three this number three the page I will put to number number five then same like this page number three I will duplicate one more time and then click and drag to behind becoming page number six so now this empty page I will be delete okay now the I want to do is adjust the second when we click the times they will come five seconds we can adjust here about maybe 2.5 second and then apply to all page this is uh, optional you can adjust to three second or four second everything is up to you so I just repeat the page one page two and page three copy and duplicate becoming totally becoming six six pages so now I will come to each another page to add the track section transition you just choose the match and move beta after that the duration is two uh, sorry is a five zero point five second and then you can apply between all page okay all page so now once it's everything done okay we well, let's check it out the final result I just played it Okay, tap turn, tap turn, continue tap turn, like a roller machine animation. So you also can do to like uh, you can add in the music. Okay, upload. Okay, music audio. So I have some audio. Okay, sorry about that because sometimes the Canva will be a little bit delayed. So, for example, I just click. Oh, oh, sorry, undo. So this one I will put the beginning, and then just drag and drop, or just click, double click. So now I just click over here, then he will play the music. Okay, this is today my tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this video. See you in the next video soon. Bye-bye.